Today, I have a few things that are on my agenda and one of those things is to get my roots done. My hair is growing so fast. So I am gonna go see Captain today. And after that, I do have some editing to do and I'm gonna try to start packing for my new apartment. So I'll talk about this in detail, but yes, I am moving this month and you guys will be getting a few moving blocks because I wanna show you guys the process of how we're gonna move everything from this apartment to the next. And also I wanna do like an empty house tour and answer all the frequently asked questions from my previous apartment hunting vlog. So stay tuned for those. Okay, I'm going to wash my face and in the morning I do like to just use water instead of any products because I just, I'm kind of lazy like that. And my dermatologist said that that's totally fine. So I'm going to wash my face. For toner, I'm going to be using the Laneige Cream Skin Quick Skin Pack and I love these. They're one of my favorite products of the summer because they're very convenient to use. And I like using this in the morning because I get to just kind of wipe away all of the dust because I don't use a cleanser in the morning. Um, water helps but sometimes I just want to make sure. So this like tones, cleanses, and moisturizes the skin. So I love these pads. Moving on to the skin booster, I'll be using Sorasu's Concentrated Ginseng Renewing Serum. And I've been using a lot of Sorasu serums lately, um, ever since the beginning of this year. I really like how luxurious they are. And this one in particular, the key ingredient is ginseng. Um, ginseng is a very popular ingredient amongst Korean women and skincare in general because it has a lot of anti-aging properties and most ginseng products they extract the ingredients from the ginseng root but this product is different because they extract from the leaf stem and the roots so you get a lot of ginseng and my skin just feels very smooth after using them like a lot of the Sarwasu products that I have tried it feels very luxurious and it provides provides that instant glow right after you apply it onto your skin. And for cream, I'll be using the Joan Day Cream. I've been using a lot of the samples, that's why my case is different from your guys's. And I'm almost done with this sample. This is actually the last one that I have. And I had about like four with me at home. All right, let's go do our makeup. <laughs> been so jet lagged um i woke up at four today was on my phone responding to emails and that kept me up for a couple hours and i went back to sleep around seven and then woke up again and right now it is currently 11 22 and today i am going to challenge myself to not use the phone throughout the day because i've been so glued to this and i've been getting really stressed because of like all the workload and I'm constantly trying to respond right away. So I'm going to save all those emails and text messages and notifications and respond to everything tomorrow all at once instead of throughout the day. So I'm going to leave my phone at home today and I'm kind of nervous about it because for things like taking the subway, I like to use my app to see the map. So now I'm gonna have to look for the map and look on look for like transfers and whatnot and i am going out today i have to go get my roots done and luckily i know where it is so i won't be needing my phone i do have a lot of editing to do so i will be on final cut pro but i'm gonna try my best to not open the browser and respond to emails and whatnot so today the phone is going to be off and i'm going to leave it here so that's the plan all right that should be a fun day
For lunch, my mom made puchim because it's actually raining today and this is like the food a lot of Koreans eat when it rains. So, 잘 먹겠습니다! I won't be having my phone, I'll be taking a book and my vlogging camera. Right when I arrived, let's go on inside. Thank you, Captain! Alright, what time is it? It's 5 o'clock. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Thank you! I love the color and I definitely needed to trim my bangs. Now, I am going to walk over to the subway station. There's one problem. I left my card behind my phone because that's where I keep my transportation card. So I'm probably gonna have to buy the um, temporary cards when I'm at the station. And I also have to look at the map to see where I have to transfer because usually I do all of that on my phone. But so far it's been really nice to just kind of be, just kind of be offline. That's been really nice. Let's start packing. This room stresses me out and I'm going to start boxing this room first because there are a lot of little things that needs to be organized. Um, a lot of products. This is my closet slash beauty room and when I move, I'm going to make sure that my office space and my um, bedroom, it's clean because I hate coming into this room. Here's a glimpse of what it looks like right now on just this corner. And we have clothes here. Um, it's a mess. I have a lot of organization to do right now. So let's begin. <laughs> time to remove my makeup my favorite part of the day is removing my makeup because I don't know after a long day it just feels so good to pamper yourself and I have a few products that are familiar and maybe a new one actually maybe one new one um, but the reason why I've been trying out so many different products these days was because I am trying to start my beauty channel again and in order for me to come back I feel like I have to um, have new products to share with you all because 
I'm the type that I don't like to experiment when I discover something that I like but I know that some of you guys do get tired of seeing the same products over and over again so I have been slowly but surely taking um, trying new products so I've been taking my time uh, right now I am using the then I met you cleansing balm this I have been using pretty much throughout the year it's my favorite oil based cleanser for water base i'll be using glow recipes blueberry gentle cleanser with my luna i love using this because it thoroughly cleanses the skin it's different Moving on to toner, this cream skin right here has been one of my favorites. Um, this is actually my second bottle, not because I finished the first, but my friend absolutely loved it and I just told her that she could keep it and I ended up just purchasing a new one. So this has been one of my favorite products that I discovered during spring? No, summer because perfect for lazy girls. It's toner and moisturizer and first I do like using a cotton pad to make sure that my cleansing routine was flawless and then I like to layer it once. I do like to apply a moisturizer afterwards because it has been feeling a bit dry these days. I think it's because of all the traveling and all the flights I've been on. Next, it's time for eye cream and I have been using the L'Occitane one, but I'm going to show you guys this new product right here. It's from Glow Recipe. I actually tried this on the back of my hand when I went to the event in LA. It definitely feels so good and moisturizing around my eyes. Moving on to the skin boosters, I'll be using the Sorasu Concentrated Ginseng Renewing Serum. Now, I have been using a lot of Sorasu serums lately since the beginning of the year and I do love how luxurious it feels on the skin and every morning I wake up to this amazing glow. I got a facial done at Sorasu during the summer and right after the treatment, I noticed an instant like glow and I was so obsessed with it I actually went out to meet up with my friends for dinner without any makeup on and they were pretty impressed by the glow too and Sarazu they just know how to make like luxurious products that are great for anti-aging and yeah so far so good this definitely along with a lot of Sarazu products has that ginseng medicinal scent but I don't mind it. It does go away after you pat it down. So yeah, that's the serum. And for moisturizer, I'll be using the Joan Day Cream. So that's it for my nighttime skincare routine. I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning everyone, it is now time to turn on my cell phone and before I do so, I kind of wanted to share my experience. My job is social media, so I am constantly checking my phone for messages, comments, uh, emails, and I try my best to respond as quickly as possible um, to brands. And uh, it was really nice to not look on the phone because even though we have weekends, I'm constantly kind of on the go and there are different time zones. So um, I get emails like all throughout the day really. So it was really nice to just kind of, I guess, be offline and I would recommend it for everyone who is glued to their phone, like maybe on a weekend or so because you get a lot of things done. I was so productive and I'm very proud of it. So now it is time to turn on my phone and let's respond to these messages. <laughs> <laughs> 